Mutt, if you had to pick a long shot that could make some noise here, who would it be? Charge it is one I was looking at that I think is interesting. I think 20 to 1 are the latest odds that I saw on Charge It. Uh, going to be it's what the uh, eight post here, Charge It. W- w- what's your pick? Uh, g- give us a, a horse or two down the board that you, you at least think is intriguing here. Well, Charge is one of the two at 20 to 1 or better that, I, that I'm going to be interested in using uh, for sure. And you mentioned it uh, coming out of the Florida Derby. He's a young horse. I, I think it's one of these horses that would not surprise me if you know he runs an okay race here, but then is even better in the Belmont. Todd Pletcher does a great job. Todd Pletcher is trainer at getting horses ready for the final leg of the Triple Crown. This is only his third start of his career. All three have happened this year. He has really, really good talent, and I, I, I'm going to use him underneath for sure at 20 to 1. The other one, who is 20 to 1, they can get every bit of that, is the number 12, 13 horse, excuse me, Simplification, who ran in the Florida Derby against a bunch of these last time out and just was part of a pace that collapsed. And I mentioned Classic Causeway. He was battling Classic Causeway early in the Florida Derby. Uh, Classic Causeway ran dead last. Simplification held on for third. And I think he got a, a bad uh, setup in that race. He'll get a much better setup in this one. Jose Ortiz, one of the best jockeys in the country. And so at 20 to 1, Simplification is actually the horse that I uh, pick second in this race. The most interesting horse is a horse named Taba on the outside. And he's going to get a lot of buzz. I know my buddy Matt Bernier from NBC Sports Edge. He likes this horse. This horse is making the third start of his career. He had no starts as a two-year-old. Uh, if he wins, guys, I lose. If, if Taba is able to find a way to win this race, I just can't imagine a horse with that little seasoning, the number 12 horse for Timmy Yock team and Mike Smith, the veteran jockey. That's a horse that I'm against. In this one, in fact, both California horses, Messier named after Mark Messier uh, and Taba are two horses that if they're in the top uh, you know, finishers in the race, I will not be cashing on Saturday. 